Welcome back to more Earthworm Gym. Last time, we did the two evilest levels in the game, at least the first half. <laughs> I was about to say, I'll take your word for it. The rest of the yeah. game is plain sailing from here. <laughs> oh yeah, totally. Now we come into the bad half of the game. <laughs> <laughs> the bad half. Yep. We, we were in the good half, now we're in the bad half. Oh yeah, totally. Start, starts with snort a problem and then goes downhill from there. Mm-hmm. I don't know if there's anybody I trust to be my, uh, my driver through this, uh, this ordeal. It, it would be you. I don't think I would pick anybody else. Why is that? Um, well, I don't feel like driving. There's nobody else who wants to uh, drive their way through Earthworm Jim, <laughs> especially in 2018. So I guess uh, you'll have to do. I only did it because I'm the only one willing to take the bullet. <laughs> you took one for the team. The Team Crass Commentaries. Yep. Subscribe today. There's, there's going to be some sort of subscribe visual. I'll, I'll put something in there. Maybe something drawn crudely in MS Paint. No, we're not going to spend um, eight minutes of this 17-minute video shilling for subscriptions. No nope. likes or, or clicks or views. We're going to be spending 19 minutes of it. <laughs> Subscribe today. And yet another extra continue. Which we're going to need in the bad half of the game. Yep. Uh, playing through this game uh, non-recorded and casually, quote-unquote... I use most of them in butt bill. Nicely done. Oh, the first it's not a problem is easy. It's basically a tutorial to let you know this is how you attack them. Now it's not a problem too. Still easily doable. It teaches you more that he will attack back now and that thing in the bottom can now kill you. And then I assume there's a part three where it's absolute chaos. Yep. Good to know. Depending on how the game feels, you can get completely boned over. I don't even remember how well this went, so. Oh my god. Yeah. I see what you mean now, what you were saying in a previous part about RNG. He destroyed me so hard I went flying off the screen. Oh my god, you were chopped in half. Yep. That was unnecessarily graphic. Oh, video games are so violent. Yeah, but it's just a suit. I mean, he's fine. He's only in the top part of the suit. Hey, I thought I thought we were um, I thought we were subscribing to the lie that video games make make kids violent. Are, are we not doing that? Are we not? Are, nope. are we not being topical and, and relevant? No, we're we're not with that crowd. Oh, that crowd! Yes, absolutely not. That crowd that visits that website. <laughs> well, it's not just them. Yeah. They they are a symptom of, of the problem, not the cause. <laughs> oh, nobody's Here gonna know. One zombie in the horn. Nobody's gonna know what we're talking about when we say that website. Yep. There's a lot of asteroids now. Yeah, 
but they're still, for the most part, easy to dodge. And I like purposely running into them when the speed up happens because you're invincible during the speed boost. Mm. Could you say that this is a bullet hell? No. <laughs> Well, if you think about it, the, the asteroids are kind of like bullets flying at you, and you have to find the perfect pattern to avoid them. It's it's a bullet hell. This is if this is a bullet hell, it's on baby easy mode. Eh, easy mode, oh. You say that there, you are being modest again about your gaming skill and ability. It's a shame we're never actually going to fight Psycho in this playthrough, because I love his theme. It's so good. I don't know his theme at all. <laughs> I think I've seen him once my entire time his, in his any theme, of the versions. His theme song is fantastic. All right, so here's level five, which isn't level five. Yeah, it's but like it's level, level five. Seven. And these enemies are the absolute worst. The little brain worms. I was about to say, that's definitely a human brain. I've seen I've seen a couple in my time. That's definitely a human brain. Oh, uh, that's a uh, brain mouse. A brain mouse. Yeah. But one is one is a genius, the other's insane. There I am making Animaniacs uh, connections again. We we should play an Animaniacs game. I have never played any of them, but I have seen someone play. I believe it was a Genesis one, way back in the day. Again, I'm while living. I'm sure one. you've seen a, a playthrough uh, of someone playing the Game Boy one with commentary by yours truly. Uh, mm -hmm. By by that website, some uh, some years back. Yep. Back back before back before it was a it was a bad place to be. Back before it became that website. Yes, when it was just the website. Now it's that website. What well, was it ever the website? I don't think it was. There's more of that excellent collision detection there. You went right through a platform trying to grab it. Yep. That's happened to me in real life a few times. I've gone right through things. Yep, and right here is where there's a whole bunch of power-ups there. Which really does help in this section, so that you don't have to worry about conserving your ammo as much. So, does the uh, console version not have those? Powers? And not from what I've seen. And I yes, don't I, believe. I, that. I remember seeing you play this section a few times actually on your previous playthrough. Yeah. There are a lot of nice idle animations in this game, too. Mm. Like that. <laughs> I think they added even more to the special edition. Can't remember, though. I remember the special edition having a lot more stuff. More levels, more skips, more weapons. You were so you were so busy enjoying the idle animation, you didn't prepare for the onslaught of whatever the hell these are. A amoeba? I you don't think? know. <laughs> <laughs> they they've got a sciency look to them. Yep. Chug, 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 chug. And if you miss any of them, they come out here. Oh my god. 
Oh, I see. So any that you fail to shoot will come back at the end. Yep. Wow. And of course, you're not expecting that the first time it happens. Nope. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. I can see how that might be considered what we call in the industry a dick move. Collision detection worked that time. I was honestly expecting to see you fall through that platform. Yeah, keeping you on your toes. Naked, Naked worm. Oh no. Oh. This, this, Rated this, R. Yeah, this video is gonna get uh, adult flagged on YouTube yep. for, for naked worms. Yep. Naked adolescent worms. Oh, that's, that's even totally worse. Worms. That's even worse. Why did you have to add adolescent to the, to the list? It's because he totally looks childish, does he not? <laughs> You're telling me that the Video Standards Council should have uh, should have banned this game. Oh yeah. Hmm. Yeah, th this was back before they subscribed to such nonsense. Yep. I mean, look at it. It's a cartoon. It's obviously meant for kids. <laughs> it's so bright and colorful. Mm -hmm. You just buy this game for your kids and then you go off and do a line of coke, you know, just leave them on their own to, to look after themselves. And then they see a worm in the nude! Oh, yeah. Little Timmy will be scarred for life. Mostly by the difficulty of this game. Yes, the the difficulty is the most scarring part of, it, of Earth One Gym. Followed by Dan Castellaneta. No, I'm kidding, he's great. The the voice of Homer Simpson is is fine in Earthworm Jim. Uh, he's only the voice in three. I don't remember who voices him in one and two. It's also the voice in the show. I'm but... pretty sure it's Dan Castellanet in the uh, in the first game. There's only one way to find out. Wikipedia, don't worry, I'm on it. Based on the video game with the same name. Okay, here we go. Um, history. Oh gosh, where is the? search within a page function. Uh, control F. Uh, on a mobile phone. <laughs> uh, can't you just like hold down and then push some sort of function? Yeah, but it thought I wanted to uh, do a Google search on the punctuation symbol full stop. Okay then. <laughs> Easiest way to defeat this guy, just get to the side of him, and then if he backs up into the end of the chain, he runs away. Uh, Ten April, apparently. The voice yeah. of Jim. Fair enough. I just saw Menace to the Galaxy and it made me uh, shudder a little on the inside. I have that game. I, I like to forget that game exists. A lot of people Oh, that's, that's the scientist with the monkey for a head. What, what's his mm -hmm. name? Greg? Pro Professor Monkey for a Head. Yeah, it's 
<laughs> so, something like that. That's that is his name. <laughs> what was it with things that are obviously not for kids having cartoon adaptations? You've got Earthworm Jim, you've got Ghostbusters, Evolution, The Mask. Evolution had nothing to do with the movie at all. Ace Ventura. And they got uh, kids shows because kids loved them. And heck, even I had a uh, Robocop toy. Ah uh, yes, the Robocop cartoon, I completely forgot about that. Mortal Kombat had a cartoon, Street Fighter had a cartoon. I can understand Street Fighter having a cartoon. Double Dragon had a cartoon too. Yes, Double Dragon, of course. That that doesn't really uh, count as a as a childish property, but uh, that had a cartoon. I guess back in those days, it, it printed money. Mm -hmm. These days, a cartoon, not so much. If you're not some massive breakout thing, then uh, then nobody's really going to notice your cartoon these days. Is that a secret? It sort of is. Uh, it actually gives you random stuff. Oh. Like, you could get a ton of lives from it. But if you try to milk it after a certain point, it only spawns those things from heck. Oh, right. So, um, you have to decide when to stop hitting it, otherwise you'll, uh, you'll have a bad time. Now it's time to make a chicken cry. Oh, <laughs> who came up with that hilarious pun previously? Uh, there's only the one phase of him in this version of the game. And he's another joke. Oh, nicely done. And that's it for this one, it seems. Indeed. Well... Yeah, there, there'll be, uh, I'm guessing, a link to, to another playthrough that we've commentated and, and something. Yeah, you know how it is by now. Do, do you want to say it this time? Sure. Let's join us next time. Same cross time, same calm channel.